Hello viewers, DV Zilan welcomes you to NMMS examination preparation, Scholastic Aptitude Test SAT 9th video. Class 9, Social Studies 9, 8th chapter Industrial Revolution. First question, in England, the cloth traders set up small workshops called Correct answer, Manufactories. Second question, the craft production phase in which control of the trader over the craft persons increased is called Correct answer, Proto-Industrialization. Third question, the main features of Proto-Industrialization are Correct answer, all the above. More and more people entered craft production. Traders established control over the workers. A large market for craft products developed across the world. Fourth question. The machine which could spin a large amount of yarn in a short time was. Correct answer. Spinning jenny. Fifth question. Who invented steam engine? Correct answer, James Watt. Sixth one. A new system called the factory system emerged between. Correct answer, 1750 to 1850. Seventh question. The large place where production was carried out was called. Correct answer. Factory. Eighth question. The child labor was banned both in Europe and US after the year. Nineteen thirty six. Question number nine. All the facilities needed for production were owned and managed by individuals called. Correct answer. Capitalists. The workers organization demanded for. All the above. 8 or 10 hours working day, higher wages, not employing children under 14 years of age in mines or factories. Question number 11. Who were employed to work on machines for meager wages? Correct answer both A and B. Women and children. Question number 12. The energy needed to run machines in a factory is available from Correct answer all the above Coal, Electricity, Petroleum Question number 13 The invention of Dash boosted the shipping industry Correct answer, steam engine. Question number 14. Shipping reduced the cost of transportation to dash of the cost of the road transport. Correct answer, one third. Question number 15. Steam locomotive was invented by. Correct answer, George Stephenson. 16th question. Who devised a method of laying the road using broken stones in 1840s? Correct answer, John McAdam. Question number 17. In the early 20th century, an aircraft was developed by Correct answer, Wright Brothers. 
क्वेश्चन नंबर 18 द कंट्रीज हूज रिसोर्सेस आर यूज्ड फॉर द बेनिफिट ऑफ अनदर कंट्री आर कॉल्ड करेक्ट आंसर कॉलोनीस क्वेश्चन नंबर 19 डैश कंट्रीज एक्सप्लॉइटेड द कॉलोनीस इन अदर कॉन्टिनेंट कंट्रीज एंड ग्रीव वेल्दी इन द प्रोसेस करेक्ट आंसर यूरोपियन क्वेश्चन नंबर 20 द शिफ्ट ऑफ पीपल फ्रॉम विलेजेस टू टाउन्स इज कॉल्ड करेक्ट आंसर अर्बनाइजेशन क्वेश्चन नंबर 21 द वर्कर्स रेजिडेंशियल एरियाज दैट लैक्ड प्रॉपर वेंटिलेशन हेल्थ एंड सैनिटेशन फैसिलिटीज आर नोन एज करेक्ट आंसर स्लम्स ट्वेंटी सेकेंड क्वेश्चन द फर्स्ट लोकोमोटिव रैन बिटवीन करेक्ट आंसर लिवरपूल टू मैनचेस्टर क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेंटी थ्री आईडेंटिफाई द फाल स्टेटमेंट अबउट पुटिंग अवट सिस्टम करेक्ट ऑप्शन इज स्पिनर्स टू काटन टू द व्यूवर्स द करेक्ट स्टेटमेंट फॉर दिस फॉल स्टेटमेंट इज द ट्रेडर्स टू काटन टू द व्यूवर्स क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेंटी फोर विच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग इज करेक्ट इन द फैक्ट्री सिस्टम करेक्ट आंसर ऑल द एबव ऑल production activities were carried out in the same place the workers worked for wages and did not own the things they produced all the production facilities were owned and managed by capitalists question number 25 the period of beginning of industrial revolution was correct answer 1750 to 1850 26th question the industrial revolution started in the country of correct answer england thank you for watching this video let us meet with next lesson thank you